second biggest mutton of the day. <laughs> What's up guys, Wayne here. Welcome to Sea Pro Fishing. Today I'm out of the St. Lucie Inlet fishing the treasure coast of Florida on the Six Mile Reef and we're looking for mutton snapper. Tomorrow's Father's Day, so happy Father's Day to all you dads out there and we're hoping to get some snapper dinner. Also, maybe something else will good will swim by, hit the flat line, who knows? So, tight lines, here we go. Take long on that one. Came up and grabbed that pilchard. Beautiful, wow. Yep, that fish is about 22. What a gorgeous, gorgeous fish. Start the day, wow. All right, let me show you guys the rig I'm using to get these muttons. All right, first I stopped using the egg sinkers because they were, you know, they chafed the line, especially braid, if you're using braid. So I use these uh, plastic sliders and it gets stopped by the swivel. Obviously use a larger swivel. It's got a clip. I can change my weights easy in and out depending on the current. And then I'll use anywhere between 30 and 50 feet. Uh, this one is 25 pound fluorocarbon leader. And we're using, um, fresh cut bait on this one so I go with a little bit of a smaller hook oh, just put a knot in there and that is a 2 Gamagatsu octopus circle and just leave it in gear and it will set the hook for you every time on the other rod I got a little bit heavier fluoro I got 30 on there sometimes I go up to 40 but today I have 30 oh I just got hit Oh, that's a screamer. Oh, 
Oh, just tighten the drag on him. We got a big fish. Holy crap. We got a big fish. Oh, I gotta remember, this is only, just telling you guys, 30 pound fluorocarbon. So there is a stinger rig on here. So hopefully we, we got him right in a stinger. This is gonna be the first really big test for this Speedmaster. This is when you just wish you had, if I had double the leader on here, I'd put some pressure. This feels like a big shark though. Yep, that's what it feels like. That's what it feels like, a big shark. good drag on us wow so smooth yeah see the way the rod is just lifting dead weight who knows that's what I'm thinking oh wow <laughs> yeah, this is a big old shark. Can't see any color yet. There he goes, fine, taking some line. Gonna back off a little bit because 30 pound liter. All right, guys, so I'm gonna turn the GoPro off, and either I come back and I lost him, or I come back and he's getting close. Whew, we are 30 minutes in. Where is this fish? 30 pound leader. Oh, head shake, I felt like a shark. Oh. He's head shaking. That means he's getting whooped. And so am I. That 30 pound leader finally gave way. He was right there, so I didn't even see him. Didn't even see him, he was right there. <sighs> yeah, pretty sure it was a shark. All right, back to the snapper. Yeah, definitely a shark, guys, because frayed all the way up the leader. And you can see it finally, the sandpaper of his skin finally sawed through. So as I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted by the tax man, is the other rod's got a heavier fluoro because I'm using a live pilchard 
close to the bottom, probably suspended about 20, 30 feet. So we're gonna use a 30 to 40 pound fluoro instead of a 25 when we've got the cut pilchard on the bottom, dedicated strictly for mutton. Um, the mutton, they will come up off the bottom. They fed up on the surface, I've seen it. So it's kind of crazy. Uh, also, always have your flat line out, live pilchard straight back. You never know what's gonna swim by. Sailfish, mahi, you don't know. <laughs> Did not have the camera going. Unfortunately, Ooh, almost lost that guy. I think he's gonna be a little short. Yep, he's 18. Yep. That's two. There's another. Oh, we're on him now, baby. Get him up. I don't want to get short. Come on. You just gotta really muscle these fish up with the sharks. I'm over a good, good school right now. Yep, short. Brought him up so fast though. Here we go, mutton. That's a good one too. Oh, that's a good fish. Come on. No, don't get sharp, come on. Get up here, come on. I want this one. Yes. <sighs> yes. <sighs> That's a man. I thought he was on me the twenty two. That's a fat twenty. We got one going, so come on. Mm. Oh, yeah. That was on a live hole picture. Stinger rig on it. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Oh. Look at that. One to go. One to go. Second biggest mutton of the day. <laughs> 21 incher. One more to go for limit, baby.